Hey, what's your name? My name is Hector. Hector, what do you do? Uh, I work for a living. Work for a living? Yeah. And this is part of what you do? This is part of how I spend my Saturdays, you know, um, enjoying life, working, making fun of myself. Make big, branches? <laughs> picking up. Can we see some of your day? Sure. So is this part of your day? This is part of my day, that's for sure. Do you know how to work a forklift? I know how to work a forklift like it's a horse. And working a forklift is part of your day? That's right, I'm like a, I'm like a forklift cowboy. Well, let me see in action. Alright. If I go in there... Through skill. Talk loud, Hector, because I can't hear you. This is through skill. There we go. Did I break some? No, nope, you got caught on one, though. There you go. Oh, there you go. Let's say something very heavy. That's pretty much it. You know? Put yeah. it elsewhere. Yep, yeah. and what would you do with it? Well, what would I do? I would, uh, now that I found a, a special place for it, now that I found a special place, I'll just put it in there. Yeah. And that's pretty much it. All right, so you'll get a call on the radio, right? And you'll jump in your golf cart. I'll jump in my golf cart. Right, like and, for instance, uh, okay, for instance? For instance, uh, they asked me to grab the, they bring the shovel for obvious reasons, and get, they asked me to get a get a shovel like this one here, and just walk to where the pebbles are. There's some pebbles here. They asked me to some pebbles and start making the dog go stop and shoveling it to another place. You know, like kind of like this. You know. Trying to dig a trench. This is like, like desert land over here. You ever try to dig a hole, a trench in the desert? No. Nope. You hit a ladder. See, back in Arizona, way up, you know, Arizona, it's like this. It's a lot of, a lot of pebbles and stuff like that. Wonderful stuff. There's definitely no gold in here, guys. Definitely no gold. No gold. What do we got? No fool's gold here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I guess. Go ahead. It's fool's rocks because I'm the fool for doing this in the top sound. But that's like that. Raw footage. I call this uh, the gray brick road. The gray brick road, what do you call it? Yeah, because it's, 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 see, this is like a wrong way to dreams. You know what I mean? So what do you dream about? I dream about. Getting a, maybe a music a contract. My dream is to not to be rich, but to do the stuff I, I dream about. You know. Oh, there's my friends there. That's Harvey and Stevie. <laughs> okay. Are they? The uh, girl you talk the, yeah, the girl is the big one. Oh, okay. That's Harvey and Stevie. They're very nice. I'm waiting for them to get bigger so I could uh, maybe eat them. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know. <laughs> Okay. So I'm them up for uh, Thanksgiving. Okay. All right. Very good. So anyway, this wonderful road here. Wow. Anyway. Oh wait a minute. We're in the wrong side. Okay. Um. I just want you know. I just don't. I don't want to be rich. I don't want to have like a lot of women. Just one. That it looks good and it's beautiful. Right. Loves me. So, right. if, if if you ask me what what's the scariest thing for me is to I'm 44 now. Although I, I look like I'm in my 20s. Good for you. I got good jeans. I mean, the top inclined. Get a jeans. <laughs> anyway, no. Um, it's like end up being like a hobo. Right. Uh, having nobody, having no family, no kids, and just die, and nobody knows anything about me. You know what I mean? It's like, um, you know, like, came and never um, went and never did anything significant. Right. That's, that's not what I want to do. Love the most? Yeah. Um, believe it or not, what I love the most is my mother. Really? Yeah, she's actually my hero. 
Really? Why is she here? Well, you know, she gave me life for one. This life is not half bad, it's very good. Um, I love making people feel good, you know. I love that. And I just love to have a good time, you know. I love to dance, have fun, you know. That's Very what cool. I, that's, that's I love. The good things I love. Like. What makes me laugh? Yeah, what makes you laugh, Hector? What makes me laugh is pretty much my luck. Tell me about it. The, the one that makes me laugh is... Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. I'm coming, uh, I'm coming to work, right? And uh, everybody is like smiling you know usually when i come to work nobody's smiling because i got a different look but everybody's smiling it's like a lot of wonder you know a lot of laughter going on you know giggles and stuff when i come in and they ask me they they're talking about doing some heavy work like you know chipping rocks and whatnot and they were wondering who wanted to do it nobody wanted to do it but when i came in everybody was smiling at me i go to the office and the boss didn't see me but I was there standing, he wasn't paying attention to me. And he told the other guy, well, the Comanche can do it. You know, he, he's a desert dweller. He could be outside in the hot sun. So practically that's one of the things that make me laugh. You know, it's like anything that can happen will happen. Let's uh, do the toilet gag. The toilet gag. Well, I just got a call. Okay, what's the call? Over the radio. Okay. Let's be in the room. This is what I. This is where my radio resides. Resides in my boot. Okay. They asked me uh, about fixing a toilet bowl. Yep. But it's uh, not flushing, and they're making a big bee hoo hoo about it. So I reckon I'm gonna go head on and take care of the dog gone toilet. Do it. What now? What now? That if you don't have anything to believe in life. You know what I mean? And you, right. and you give up, well, guess what? You, you, you'll be easy to control. That's what I tell my, uh, my American Indian uh, tribes, our people. Never lose hope. Because the day you lose hope, you'll be easy to control. And the ghetto, and the reservation is not a place. It's a condition. You know, it's here. This is where the ghetto is, in the mine, right here. Right. So. You gotta believe in yourself. Is that what gets you through your day? This is what gets me through the day. Yeah. You know? Your you know, day. Uh, I, I bring, you know, I try to leave the dream, the dreams and desires and hopes of all our people inside of me. And that's why no matter how hard they get, the day gets, I mean, believe me, they get hard. <laughs> I mean, it's like, sometimes I feel like I'm sling blade. It gets hard, that hard. But, I don't give up. And I make I'll make it and I'll make it forward. Oh look nice shade. Uh, what what do I got in my pockets? Um I got uh, my lucky charm. You know, it's from our Native American peoples. You know kind of all that kind of stuff. Um got an iPod connection here, you know, for my music. My Apple stuff. I do carry a lot of stuff also in uh, my boots because I usually don't can can handle carrying stuff in my pocket. But I got a lot of stuff. I got my lucky screwdriver, my radio, my phone, and it gets hot out there. So when I go and see pretty girls, I kind of put some perfume on. And also carry some rope. Don't try this at home, folks. All right. Baby, you went off. It's fixed. <laughs>